There is a very interesting application you can use to control motion sickness and I'm going to install it here and we're going to see what it does to trick your brains because motion sickness usually happen due to your brains getting conflicting signals from your body. Like your eyes would perceive that you're moving but your inner ear is not perceiving any movement or the vice versa so we are going to correct one of them which is the eyes so there is an application what you need to do is just go to the store and uh, just the play store this is android i think even uh, ios usually have that i don't know um just go to search and look for this application can stop app and uh, install it it'll take some few minutes based on uh, how fast or how slow your internet is but it's a very small one so now that it's installed open it up and there is the first permission that you need to grant it you know it's very important because you're going to see it uh just go to this and then make sure this is on now what you can do from this point is you can change the theme but before you get there just play it now after tapping on this play button you can see we have some dots that are moving based on uh, the orientation of the phone what's happening so this is I know where you are headed now, so you can change the theme and all that. You can just put whatever you are comfortable with and all that. Now, uh, the reason why we are granted the draw over the other application is so that you can be doing other things and at the same time, you can be having this correction going on. Now, most of the time is your eyes cannot be able to extrapolate your position based on what you are getting into your brain. So it perceives where you are at a certain time when you're moving. But if you have this conflicting, you can use this application to try to guide your brains into now what's going on. Because if you're moving, this will imitate the movement that will happen. And this correction will go directly to your eyes and it will go to the brains. And this signal coming from your eyes will be congruent with what will be coming from your inner ear. So there will be no conflict. Now the reason why we drew over other applications is so that you can be doing other things. Like for example, let's go to TikTok. You, you still can see what's going on. You still have the dots in any application that you have. Maybe you're chatting, so you can still continue doing that. And also the perception of the, uh, the extrapolation of the distance can also be corrected by the dots that you can see on the screen in as much as you can change, uh, you can change the theme to whatever you want. Like you can go to animals, uh, see, space and uh, whatever. So what's going on here is uh, it's correcting that. So yeah.